Hey everybody, Ramey here. Um, so I was creating a presentation the other day and one of the things that PowerPoint has is their design ideas. And it's actually a really, really, really cool feature. And we'll, let's play around with it a little bit. Um, and we are going to create the design for this video. So whatever I create is the design I'm gonna use, but let's have some fun with the tool first. This is a fun tool and I wanna to kinda of go through it. <laughs> All right, and you can see it's already popped up on the screen. So what I've done here is I've simply just opened up PowerPoint, a blank presentation. So you can see there's nothing on the screen here, but what PowerPoint does, which I think is kinda of cool. So let's see, I am going to just delete this and I am just gonna type something in. Let's type in the word Apple. So when I type in the word Apple, if I go to design, design ideas, notice it's already up over here. So what PowerPoint does, which I think is brilliant, I actually love this, I use it all the time. So I love this feature, which is why I wanted to show you guys because I think it's really cool and fun and it's kind of funny to see like what they show you sometimes. But if you type something in, it tries the AI, that whatever AI algorithm they're using in the background is trying to figure out a good like layout for your presentation, maybe just an image slide, maybe like the front slide, maybe the master slide, whatever it is you're trying to do. They are trying to figure out what is a cool way to present this slide. Now I use this feature all the time. So let's say like I'm creating a presentation of 30 slides. I will go through each one of those 30 slides. I will put all my content on the slide and then I will go to design ideas because they will rearrange the slide and make it look good for me, which I love. So let's take a look at what this Apple did. So we, if we look here on the right hand side, we can see I just typed in the word Apple. The first picture looks like it is an actual Apple. So they found an apple that's free to use, you know, like an open source um, image that they allow me to use. But they also give me like some cool different like ideas. Like I can take this and I can bold it. And like all of a sudden I have like apple or like this one. And notice when I selected the apple, now all my, all my little layouts here, all that image just in different formats. So it's actually really, really, really neat that they're, that's pretty cool. I like that. I don't like that. That doesn't fit. But you can see like they're giving you all these different layouts. Now let's say like I kind of like this one, but I wish there were like more options similar to it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to close design ideas and I'm going to click it again because then it like rearranges through. Oh yeah, I like this one better. And then there's some of the other ones. Oh, but they've added some new ones in here. This one's new. But whatever you type in, Let's just see like what it does. What if I type in cat? What do they got for me? Oh, they're still stuck on this Apple idea. Let's get, let's see cat. I might need to create a whole new blank presentation. Okay, file new blank presentation. Let's type in the word cat, see what they come up with. Cause notice here on the side, like they've already got like some idea. That's pretty neat. I like that a lot for like a cool artistic picture. Some of these are awesome. Like I just I'm like, wow. Like you can make me look like I know what I'm doing like in PowerPoint without knowing anything. Cat. Oh, I should. Wow, look at that. Okay, so there we go. That's pretty cool. It's like that, uh, you know, I've been talking about the, hold on. <laughs> Let me do another one, another blank. I've been talking about the Tiger King show because it's freaking hilarious in my videos lately. So what is the late, so if we did like a tiger one, there's only one tiger? Hold on, there's gotta be more tigers. Let me unclick this and click it again. Let's find some more tigers. Oh, that's the only tiger picture they have. The woman that the tiger guy doesn't like, it. she's like, when she does her YouTube videos, she's like, hey there, you cats and kittens, or something like that. <laughs> I just thought that was hilarious when she said that. I thought that was like funny. So I could be like, if I was doing a presentation on cats, I would have my tiger picture, and I'd be like, hey there, you cats and kittens. <laughs> I just think that's freaking hilarious. Um, no, but this is awesome. It's such a cool feature. Okay, so we kind of have played around with this. I've showed you like what it does. Let's do one more just for the fun of it. And you know, I'm actually gonna show you some presentations I've developed using this feature completely just to show you how cool. Let's, so what should we type in? Let's type in something like a little more professional. Let's type in like, 
eh, this is not professional. I don't know why I thought, thought of the word graduation. I guess because, like, students are graduating. Okay, so there's, like, confetti, the first one. The other ones make no sense. So that's, like, confetti. I don't mean I don't like this how this word looks, but what we would do is design ideas, click it again, let the AI think. Okay. Well, now the word pops, it pops out a little bit. I love this, like, darkened background a little bit. Oh, this is cool. It, like, blurred part of it to make the word stand out. That's a little, that's pretty neat. Nah, I don't like that too much. But you get the general idea. Like, there's a bunch of cool stuff you can do. Okay, so let me pull up a presentation that I've done using this feature. And then let's actually make a slide for the video that you're watching right now. Okay, so... Here is a presentation that I've made using this feature. So this is a presentation that I did on eSports. So you can see I use this design ideas for every single slide you're seeing. I pulled up on this slide, I pulled up three images and wrote something in and I went to the design ideas. I like this layout. Another example, check it out. They put the, pull these two images, they put the background in all nice, all my content is right there, perfect for And notice how each slide, like I don't use, so when I'm, I'm developing a presentation, I don't like to always have like the same necessarily look for every single slide. I'd rather develop each slide, not opposite one another, but like they have a good look for the slide. So like you can see, these two slides, actually these three slides are all very similar. But I've used this design for every single one of these slides, you know, because I really, really, really like the feature. It's pretty cool. And this was a presentation I did about esports. You can see like there are some pictures of my club and stuff. That's our shirt, which is pretty cool, right? That's a pretty rad design. Some of my students developed that. They're awesome at graphic art, and they actually took that to one of their pictures. Awesome. Here's it. Oh man, this is so cool. Some of the banners for the stuff they've created for our tournaments awesome stuff okay <laughs> i get sidetracked sometimes but that's okay all right so what i want to do though is i want to develop a slide that i am going to use for this so when i put this on youtube i am going to have like when you the intro slide that you're going to see on youtube when you find this video so we need to design it so we got to figure out what we want to do. So what's this video even going to be called? It's going to be called like design ideas in PowerPoint. I haven't thought about it yet. So that's me thinking really quick. That's like the, the quick and dirty version design. It's called design ideas, which is, a, I get where they're going with it, but I think the name is kind of lacking. Like come up with something cool, like the design ideas in PowerPoint. That doesn't even make sense. That's just like, I don't know. It just does not make sense to me. So I think I want to call it, I guess it is design ideas. It's literally like, maybe what I call it is like how to design slides in PowerPoint Let's say how to design slides in PowerPoint using the design, using, I can't even spell, using design ideas feature. I don't think I like that term. Let's just keep it there for now. Okay, so let's see what they've come up with. Oh yeah, no, no. Do we like any? Oh, that's kind of, uh, uh, you know what? I don't think I like any of these. Let's see if they give me new ones. No, they're totally not giving me new ones. Okay. Let's save this text. And let's type in something else. Let's type in PowerPoint. And now see what they come up with. Oh, so they did change. Okay. And I think because I said PPT, they're like, they don't know what that is. <laughs> Of course, they don't know what they they what what people call themselves. Okay, a little better. What about this? This isn't terrible. I mean, I don't like the big pink thing. I'm saying like this is we're getting a little better. The doctor thing doesn't make any sense. Ooh, that's really neat. Not totally not what I want to use for this, but I just like that graphic. Oh, I like this one too. 
That's pretty cool. I'm going to click this one and let's see what they come up with. Uh, this is so generic. I feel like I use this for other stuff. That's not bad. Yeah, I don't know. No. Uh uh. Uh uh. Uh uh. Not liking what I'm seeing here. Okay, let's do a whole new one. Let's just start this over. I want it fresh. Okay, here's what I'm going to type in. I think what I'm going to type in is design. Now let's see what they want to do. Okay, this is very clean. So this is kind of neat, like idea. Let's just, let me go with this for a second. I want to see what they do. <laughs> no. Okay, hold on a second. Uh-uh. 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 Are they just giving me this light? Do I really need to create a new one of these? This program, I swear, I I'm sure there's an easier way, but it's just not happening right now. Wow, so I just typed in design and did this a second ago. Okay, that's pretty neat. I'm, I'm attracted to those colors. I don't know what it is. That's pretty cool too. I really like that. Yeah, I like all, that's neat. I like that. Oh, what do I want to use? Shoot. I've never seen this background before. I think that's pretty cool. Design ideas in PowerPoint. Okay, let's see what they come up with. Not bad. I don't think that's bad. I actually think that's fine. I'm such a sucker for that background. Hold on. I don't necessarily like this text. Oh, that one's really bad. I need to do a video where we just play around with different text. What is Algerian? Where do they come up with these fonts? Oh man, I just have to see Atari Classic. Okay, hold on. Let me just find. Oh, okay. <laughs> I've got to do the Atari. I can't help it. I am a sucker for anything, anything retro. I just can't help it. Oh my god. Oh no. We don't like this. How do we get rid of that thing? Oh, I know what we need to do. Okay, let's see. Let's just stop right there. Let's see what we got. Okay. So what do we want to do? I like this. It's getting better, I feel like. There we go. I feel like we're slowly getting better. Oh my goodness. PowerPoint. You are driving me nuts. What do we think? I actually think it's kind of cool. Design ideas in PowerPoint. I like the circle. I like the background. Let me just see what they have to show me. Cause now that I'm kind of settled. No, no, no. Oh, they're still sticking with. Well, that doesn't have the circle, but I like the background. Oh yeah, that's kind of cool. No, I think I like it in the centered. Or do we like it like in the left like that? Design ideas and PowerPoint. Uh, no. Uh, that's, I think we're getting there. What if we change this font? No, I can't make it black. I don't want to do that. I don't even want to give it a stroke. We could. Oh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> no, I mean, that's neat. Oh, yeah, kind of cool. It's like, hey, oh, look at that. Look at that. Hold on. Oh, my God. PowerPoint. Let me actually move what I've selected. <laughs> no. Okay, we can't do this. 
I okay. I do think that I like the shape effects, but it's got to be like, hold on. I think that is it. I think we got it. I think that's actually pretty cool. What do you guys think? I think it's kind of cool. It, you know what? This isn't perfect. I'm not totally not trying to do that right now. Totally not trying to make something that's a hundred percent perfect right now. But I like it enough to be able to show how to use this feature and just have some fun and play around with it. So anyway, this is gonna be the slide that you see the front cover of this video. Um, and that's it. Uh, hey, so remember to subscribe to my videos. Give me a like on the video or any comments. And I hope you have a great day. Thank you all.